Hey there, it is April 2nd. So this is my March 2021 update, which is pretty good for me to only be <laughs> a couple days <laughs> into the next month uh, to do my monthly update. So I actually had a really good March. Um, I've been going pretty slow this year. Uh, I think January, it was like a 0.4 pound uh, loss. And then February was one point something. And March, I think was, I finished at like 2.4. <laughs> so I'll put all my current stats in the show more box below. But for those keeping track, I am down 135.8 from my highest weight and down 112.8 since my RNY surgery. So I am pretty happy with that. My I think I mentioned my last my last video. My goal was to get to the 170s um, in April or mid April. Yeah, mid-April, because I'm, I'm going to be going out of town. And more so because that'll be like, you know, I won't have my scale and I'll be out of town for like three weeks. Um, so I was hoping to, to hit that mark while, you know, all my scales are the same. So I guess it's doable. I'm at 184.2, so I just need to lose 4.4 pounds in the next two weeks. Um... Yeah, I think that's not gonna happen. Um, and if I did, you know, work to make it happen, um, because it would be so off pace for what I, where I've been doing, uh, it probably wouldn't last. So I'm not gonna, you know, try to meet that goal just to meet the goal, um, but I would love to. <laughs> so we'll see. Um, but yeah, I have, been plugging along um yeah the reason I am doing the video today is because I just finished like an on or camera on zoom call um which I tried to avoid like at all costs um because I don't like doing my hair I don't like I don't mind doing my makeup um but it's just that like everything else that comes with doing your makeup like showering maybe you don't have to shower um <laughs> if you're no you know not leaving the house obviously um so anyway yeah I didn't notice until this morning um because I've been wearing my hair back um and also because I have a hair, hair appointment next week how long my bangs have gotten um so they I cut about an inch off of them they were like down past my eyes um so I couldn't get away with it for this call uh so I trimmed them myself and it's really annoying trimming bangs because uh the hair like gets all over your face and so I was over the sink like this so having trying to have my hair like away from me um so it wouldn't fall on my face but fall in the sink um which also makes it like super not precise because <laughs> I'm just using like regular um, not even like sharp kitchen scissors. It's like the scissors I keep in my bathroom to like, you know, open a box or something. Um, but yeah, I think it's it's fine. And um, they'll be trimmed next week when I get, you know, a normal haircut. But that was kind of a long way to tell you <laughs> that my hair, I, I think, I keep saying it, but I'm pretty sure it's getting back to normal. Um, as far as like growth, um, because I have such long hair, it's going to be a while before it's like fully back to normal. Um, I don't know if you can, well, you definitely can't see the end, but as you can see, it is to my waist. Oh, I'm not even at the end. It's to my waist. Um, so it'll be shorter next, next month when you see me. Um, I haven't decided how much to get, but, um, this part is thickening up. Um, this part obviously is not because there's a lot to go. Uh, so I am two years and November, December, January, February, March, five months um, out from surgery and um, probably a couple months into the real growth starting. Um, 
So I was never like to the point, even though, you know, my hair is something I really like. <laughs> um, I was never to the point where like I regretted, you know, surgery just because of my hair. Um, but I know there's a lot of people that are worried about that. You know, I see in different Facebook groups, people asking questions about that, people asking questions about lots of things. Um, and I've really tried to avoid doing a rant on that. Um, I don't know if you're interested in my rant, um, let me know in the comments and nothing mean, but just some thoughts that I have as a pre-surgery person um, and a post-surgery person. <laughs> so I'll end it here. Um, like I said, I'll put everything down in the box below if you're interested in weights for someone like me who is two years and five months or so out um, because I think it's you know interesting especially if you have you know similar stats um, because I haven't come across someone with you know exactly the same stats as me maybe Grace gets gastric is probably closest to someone that had stats before me um, but also it's not necessarily comparable because she's a lot taller than I am and I'm 5'4". Not a lot taller, but a couple inches taller. Um, and also now has had um, skin removal surgery. Awesome. Um, I'm not at that point yet, um, but something I would definitely consider, um, you know, after settling to whatever uh, a normal weight is for me for a couple, a year or two, uh, probably two. <laughs> Take me at least that long to save up for it. Um, okay, that's it for now. I hope you are having a great April. I'm so happy that it is spring. Um, it has apparently not sprung here in the DC area. The high today is something like 48, um, which is probably why I'm escaping to Arizona for a couple weeks um, and to 90 there. So I'll see y'all next time. Bye.